Have you ever wondered if your partner actually enjoys your favorite sex position? Let's face it, when it comes to the bedroom, mutual pleasure is paramount. Yet, many of us navigate this intimate arena armed with assumptions and misconceptions, particularly about what women prefer. Today, we're pulling back the covers on this delicate subject. We'll explore some common beliefs about women's preferences and how these may not align with reality. So brace yourself, because reality checks can be surprising. Stay tuned as we reveal the top 5 sex positions women secretly despise. Ready for some uncomfortable truths? Here they are. First up we have the standing up position. It might be exciting in theory but in reality it's often physically demanding and can lead to discomfort. More so it doesn't allow for much intimate connection which many women value during the act. Next is the wheelbarrow. While it might seem adventurous and fun, it's actually quite strenuous. It puts a lot of pressure on a woman's arms and doesn't provide enough stimulation. The third position that's not a favorite is the reverse cowgirl. While it gives men a great view, it can feel objectifying for women. Plus, the angle can be awkward and uncomfortable. Moving on to the jackhammer. This one is pretty self-explanatory. It's intense and not always in a good way. It often leads to insufficient stimulation for women and can feel more like a workout than an intimate experience. Last but not least, we have the pile driver. It's not only uncomfortable but also potentially painful due to the extreme angle. Besides, it lacks the emotional intimacy that many women crave in bed. Surprised? Don't worry. It's all part of understanding each other better in the bedroom. Now that you know, what's next? It's time to open up the channels of communication, folks. Yes, we've discussed some uncomfortable truths today, but remember, every cloud has a silver lining. It's essential to engage in a dialogue with your partners about what you enjoy and what makes you cringe. Having these conversations can be a game changer. Consent and mutual enjoyment should always be at the forefront, trumping any specific position. It's not about what you do, it's about how you do it and how it makes both of you feel. So take these insights, start those conversations and let's make the world a better place one bedroom at a time. And hey if you found this video helpful don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button and share it with your friends. We're all about fostering healthier relationships and better understanding, and sharing this knowledge can make a big difference. Also, we'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. Your experiences, your stories, your insights matter. Remember, knowledge is power, especially in the bedroom. 